Hi everyone, thank you for watching ASFN. In this week's Ambassador Flash, quite a few catches came in from all different areas, shapes and sizes. On a recent evening excursion with Ray Thompson, Jace Govender and Mike Dyer down to the south coast, Shirley Avenue, they managed to cross paths with some smooth outs. Earlier that evening, they got bitten off several times, which they later found out was raggies. This was the first test of the four-piece grinder elites to see how they handle fish. Officially, this smooth out is the first fish caught on the new four-piece grinder elite to be released later this year. On a recent league at Cape Vital, I was fortunate enough to get some really nice edible fish. The conditions weren't ideal, but still managed to get some really beautiful specimens in several different species. The cave bass was my personal best in size and one of my favorite rockfish to catch. And the evening started off with a lovely stumpy almost making four kilos, which pulled me flat and was really a worthwhile fight. This fish put the Poseidon four to six ounce, 15 foot test rod really to the test and what a lovely rod. The Poseidon I paired up with my Saltus 5030 pound J-Braid. Earlier that day I also managed to get my personal best lemon fish. This fish I got on the medium heavy Grinder Elite. Paired up with my Saltus 6500. Mo made use of the drop in the barometer to go target some bigger sandies. A species been after to get a new PB and did just that putting his Saltigo dogfight and Dawa Saltis Grind Elite 15 foot to the test. And Linton lives his life in the small gaps where he's not fishing, but most of the time he's fishing. And if there's any nice fish swimming around in the Zululand area or on the coast, Linton is sure to be there. Got rewarded with a nice sand shark as well as a beautiful specimen of a smaller GT and a blackfin shark that always puts your tackle to the test. Linton is also the master scratcher and got rewarded with some rockod and reef fish. And Marcus is making use of the crocodile season. I think the only days Marcus is not out on the sea on his paddle ski looking for bigger fish is where the weather makes it impossible. If there's a crocodile in the area, Marcus is sure to catch it. Then Raucus really made use of his time targeting trophy specimens in several species. And if you put in the time, you get the rewards. Starting off with a really good sized giant guitar fish of 245 centimeters. This rock got on his Daiwa tournament 15 foot and his Daiwa Saltus 8000. Paired up with 40 pound J braid. Rock was also rewarded with an absolute prize catch of a giant Trevelli down in the Transkai area. Rourke was using his Daiwa Saltus 8000, spooled up with Daiwa j 50 pound and his Daiwa Saltus Grind Elite 15 foot. Rourke managed to lure in another trophy prize catch of a Zambezi shark measuring in at 235 centimeters. Also caught in the trans sky using his Daiwa Saltus Extra Heavy Multiplier Rod paired up with his Dogfight LD60 and 65 pound j braid. Rourke got this fish on a swim bait and wherever Dean gets a gap he'll either be scratching or targeting some bigger Zululand fish and was rewarded with a couple of reef fish on a recent scratching session. Tyron Bain has been spending most of his time out on the deep in search of some good game fish and was rewarded with several nice coups and some good sized tuna. Michael Roger doing what he loves most, spinning in the morning, was also rewarded with some early season Natal snook. Climbing in under the fish in Cape Town, starting off with a nice smooth out, some cow sharks he got on his Daiwa Saltus 6500 spooled with j 40 pound and his grindy elite 14 foot 6 medium heavy. And that's also been putting in the effort to get those really big bronze whalers. And so he did using his Daiwa Tournament 15 foot, Daiwa Saltus 8000 and j 50 pound, he managed to land some really good sized bronze whalers. In between he also managed to get some flatfish and some more bronze whalers sharks. It seems like the big ones are just rolling in. On a recent scratching session on the south coast, Dean Pretorius managed to get a prize five finger. A really great catch. Dean was using his Daiwa Saltiga spooled with j 30 pound, paired with his Daiwa Saltis Grind Elite Medium Heavy 14 foot 6. Then on the freshwater side, Ryan Mateus 
Got a prize fully scale carp, really a sought after catch if you're a specimen fanatic. This session also produced some really good common carbs and the specimen ambassadors are really putting the quarter tackle to the test with some phenomenal results. That's it for our ambassador catches this week. We thank you very much for following us and please make sure you subscribe and push the little bell button to get notified every time a new video loads up.